Hi, I'm Carolyn Douglas. David and myself own Crossroads Restaurant. We opened April the 19th of 1991. This is our dog, daughter-in-law, Sandy Douglas, and she is our manager and our right-hand man. When my mother and father-in-law opened this place, originally, my sister-in-law, Melody, she ran the place. She was the manager then. And I ran Barlow's. We owned Barlow's restaurant over in 441 when it was open. And I ran Barlow's. Well, eventually, Melody went into her massage therapy business. So, and we shut down Barlow's. So I came over here and started managing Crossroads. And this place is like a place we hire people that's been in trouble and stuff and giving them second chances. And it upsets me because I think that's what the Lord wants us to do is to give people hope and know that they can go on with their lives when they made mistakes because the Lord forgives us and we want to be a reputation of Him. And um, that's why in this place here that we just recently redecorated, I want people who walk through the door to feel the presence of the Lord and know that they're loved. When we bought Barlow's, Barlow's restaurant, uh, while it was being renovated and cleaned up, we had come by crossroads going out to our property and we stopped to have a bite and we knew Sue Mobs who owned it previously. And she told David that if she knew that we, he wanted a restaurant, she'd have sold him this one. So before the evening was over, before we had finished our meal, we owned two restaurants. All we had to do was sign the papers and exchange of money. We've been here 24 years. And the thing I guess I like best about being here at Crossroads is the people that come in and the girls that we work with. Elizabeth. Jamie, I'm a waitress. Anya, I'm a cook. Amanda, I'm a waitress. Michelle. We have had some awesome girls working here and, and a couple of guys, but they don't like working here because they don't like to be told what to do by household women. But we have a lot of working men and women that come in uh, uh, and a wide range, you know, from the day workers, the cowboys, to the construction workers and the dairy workers, everyone that's around and people that stop on the way. And of course in the winter we have a lot of winter visitors come in. And we always want everybody to feel welcome, you know, no matter what kind of business you're in. And if you come in dirty, that's okay too. We understand about working people because we've worked all of our lives. And my Hi, my name's Deborah Cleveland. I've been here at Crossroads for going on 12 years. And this is how we start our mornings. We come in in the mornings and Granny, every morning, comes in, starts grits, starts sausage gravy, and does a whole big sheet of biscuits, every morning homemade. And also on this side, this is the special side, this is where we get our salad bar together. We also do all homemade cooking. Our menu varies during the week. Um, we also do a lot of bacon on this side. All of our desserts are made here at the restaurant too, which Granny puts a big hand in with the big cakes and different things she makes. Alrighty, and then we go from our special side over to our grill side where we cook from the menu. All of our breakfast is done over here. We have all different types of hot cakes. We have chocolate chip, blueberry, pecan hot cakes. We do all kinds of omelets. We have steak Philly omelets and cheeseburger omelets, which is a new thing in here. Um, at lunchtime, we have all kinds of awesome sandwiches from clubs to steak fillies, chicken fillies. We make our own burgers fresh every day. They're not frozen. We pat them out every day fresh. And that's what we use over here. Uh, one of the great advantages to having Crossroads is it's a wonderful place for our family to meet. On Saturday mornings, David comes down early with me. Of course, he's here every morning early. But he comes down early on Saturday morning and the girls will have the potatoes prepped. We fix fresh potatoes. We have a big 17 inch iron skillet and he, they fry potatoes with onions. While I'm making biscuits and the grits, they fry the potatoes. And then our sons and daughters and daughter-in-laws and uh, a lot of the grandchildren, anybody that can knows, knows grandpa is cooking daddy taters, they call them. And they come and gather around and have grits and eggs and potatoes on Saturday morning. And when David was rearranging everything in here, he built a long family table so that if you have a large family or we have groups that come from church after church and they'll call ahead and say, can we have the big table and we'll reserve it for them. I think it'll hold 20, 
total 20 people. And uh, one of our goals here at Crossroads is to have the very best home cooking that you can find anywhere. And we love for everybody to come. We try to make everybody welcome. And we like everybody to come and enjoy our good food. That's the reason we're here and that's what we strive for, is to make everybody welcome and feed them well. I wanted everyone to know that when David and I come in early to start the biscuits and the gravy and the grits and everything we do first thing to get everything open, is one of my first orders of the day is to pray over at Crossroads. I pray for all the food that's prepared and cooked and served. I pray for my workers and every customer that comes into Crossroads, I ask God to bless them. So if you come to Crossroads on any given day, you have been prayed for that day.